next lesson. Hello guys. So in our last lesson, we added a simple functionality where we could actually load this uh, audio file. We also use the operating system module to set a file name and path and also split that path so we can get the file name and the location of where that file is playing from. So let's just go ahead and test out and see if we have any other issues before we actually uh, wrap this up. So now that I have that file loaded, if I click on load song, I can actually load a song and just click on any song. So if I try to play the song, I, I see an error on line 25. So let's go ahead and see what that error is. So one of the key things in debugging is to understand where the error is, what the error is, where it's coming from, and how we can solve that problem. So it says here, the error is coming from line 25 in my play method, and it says pygame.mixer.loadf. So it said module pygame.mixer has no attributes load. So let's go ahead and see why uh, that's happening. So if I go ahead and look at my play function on line 25, so this is my line 25, and I, I know what line it is because I can see that at the bottom right of the screen. If you have an editor, some editors like uh, Visual Studio Code allow you to see the line numbers so you can actually quickly jump to where that problem is. So it says it doesn't have an attribute pygame.mixer to load. It's because we didn't add music, or rather I didn't add music. So I'm just going to say music. Yes, I see. So it's supposed to be pygame.mixer.music.load. And uh, let's just go ahead and save that. And we can actually see that it has music right here because it's giving us a uh, hint. All right. So now that we have that, let's just go ahead and save and run this application again. And let's lose a song. And let's just open this file and let's go ahead and play this file. And we have the audio file working. So let's go ahead and load another track just to test things out. So let's just try uh, any track actually. So let's go ahead and pause the track. And let's resume the track. So pause and resume and stop are all working. So one thing I noticed, I wasn't able to see my resume button. So let's go ahead and fix that uh, issue. So to fix the resume button, we'll just get down to our geometry and let's just set this to uh, 320. So let's see 320 and go ahead and just uh, run that. So good. So at 320, we can actually see our resume uh, button. So that's how you can build a uh, simple and minimal uh, audio player with uh, Pygame. Remember, Pygame is a multimedia module, so you can actually use it to also load MP4 files and you can play uh, MP4 files. Now, if we wanted to load a library of songs, instead of using the add open uh, file name, we could use file names instead and we can traverse through a uh, folder. That instead of using ask open file name, we could use ask open file names. But we want, just wanted to keep this simple. Maybe in the future lessons, I'll create an update of this application. And uh, thank you very much for watching. And uh, I'll see you in our next lesson.